my J area. You're gonna have to get out of here. I should have known you'd be involved with something like this. Are you kidding? This is the sloppiest show I've ever seen. But I never took you to be someone who got others to do their dirty work. Oh, hey, now hold it right there, short stuff. Got nothing to do with these copycats. They're stealing my thing. I only came by to make sure they give up trying to be me. You expect me to believe that you don't love seeing all these firecrackers go off? <laughs> yeah. And who's getting all the credit for it? I'm gonna split this band up once and for all and make sure they find a permanent new look. Something really smoking. I'm not gonna let you hurt them, Jinx. Uh -huh, yeah, whatever you say, Echo. Hey, why don't we see what Pow Pow thinks? Now hold still. Mount Jinx, which is never. Well then, I look forward to never seeing you again after I squash ya! Chompers, where'd you get them? <laughs> I met some twins who gave them to me in exchange for a little contract work. Wanted me to cause a big distraction so they could loot a mansion or something. Drake and Bale? Yeah, them! I turned down the offer, but snuck off with their box of sparkly bombs. Wanna see one up close?
We're not quite finished here. Do you have a way of contacting Future Echo? Sure. I've got an idea. Future Echo? I met the Finlocks leader and Camille tracked me down. She's angry about the Syntixi. She's blaming me for letting the Syntixi go. Her, her blades are two steps away. What's going on here? I knew if my life was threatened, your life would be too. You shouldn't have betrayed us. I advise you to be forthcoming, future Echo. Since you seem to know who I am, you are undoubtedly familiar with my methods of extracting information. There is a war coming. Is, is that what you wanted to know? That Piltover will crumble, screaming into golden dust? I'm trying to save both of our cities from a disastrous fate. You're forgetting one detail. He's building a bomb with the Poindestra Syntixi to blow up Piltover. To destroy the Syntixi and your Hextech Crystal Vault. It's the catalyst of the conflict. Some parts of both Piltover and Zon will get caught in the blast. It's true. But it's the only thing that will stop the war. That can't be true. There must be other options. You think I haven't tried? You think you know better than I do? I need a little more Syntixi. And then this will be finished once and for all. <laughs> He doesn't have enough Syntixi yet. There's still time. But first, I need to get back to the hideout and fix up my gear. Then I can figure out where the final Syntixi cache is and stop him. You should come too. To your... clubhouse? It's a safe place where we can piece together what we know. All right. I accept your invitation. What do you make of your future self? It's not every day that one meets their destiny. There's a lot he's hiding from me. Perhaps he believes he is protecting you. Men go mad when they know their own fate. Don't tell me that. My fate is to be an over-controlling time traveler, apparently. Why did he need you and ask for your help? He must be the only person he can trust. Himself. I was referring to your zero drive. There must not be many other time travelers in the future. Not with devices like that. And then, there's the matter of the Syntixi crystals. It seems they are rather abundant in a future zone. Possibly Piltover too. 
tension will become even worse between the two cities. Not to mention people getting hurt. Exactly. And our economy does not work particularly well when everyone is dead. Do you mind if I check in with some people really quickly? Not at all. I shall take a look at the local vendors. 